Hello, welcome to our spa. How can I help you? You have an appointment with us? Okay. Is it for the men's facial and shave? Okay. Just get you booked in. Okay, great. So, my name is Laura, and I'm going to be taking care of you today for your facial and shave. It's lovely to meet you. Have you ever visited us before? No? Well, welcome. And have you ever had a spa facial or shave before? No? Okay, you just wanted to treat yourself to something new? That's great. So, for your facial and shave today, what we have in our treatment at this particular spa is we begin with your shave, and that begins with a nice warm towel placed on your beard area. And that helps dampen the hair on your skin. And then we apply a lovely, nice and gentle exfoliant to the hair and skin of that region of your face. And that will help break up the dead skin cells and ingrown hairs that may be occurring in that area. And then we'll move on to your shave of preference. We can give your beard a trim or we can shave the entire beard off, whatever you prefer. And then, after your shave is complete, we'll be moving on to a custom tailored facial for your skin type. Sounds good? Great. So, before I begin any treatment for my clients, I like to burn a candle, just to set a nice, relaxing mood. And for you today, I wanted to suggest this lovely, balsam and clove candle, and this will let out a nice warm scent into the air, and this candle is very good for setting a nice relaxing and comforting mood, and it's also perfect for the winter season. Have a way with this, let me know what you think. You like that? Very good. So, just like that now. And we'll let that burn in the corner for you. Okay. Okay. So now I'm going to be placing this nice fluffy warm wet towel on your beard region. I'm going to dampen your beard with the towel and this will make it a little bit easier to work with the hair. I'm now just going to pat that towel over your hair. So for the first half of your treatment today, we will be focusing on your beard, and then we'll be working with your skin afterwards. Okay, so before we begin with your shave, I like to begin with a nice gentle exfoliant in the beard region. And for that, I am going to be using the Clean and Clear Morning Burst Facial Scrub. This has a wonderful, refreshing scent to it, very citrusy, and it will remind you of oranges and lemons. So this is a nice, invigorating scent. 
which as noted is very suitable for the morning or day and this contains very little beads that work as the major component of the exfoliant and this is going to help break up the dead skin cells trapped inside your beard region as well as breaking up any ingrown hairs that may be occurring within that region okay so I'm going to put just a little on my fingers Can you smell the beads? Okay. And I'm just going to Work the exfoliant into your beard just to sort of buff the area and it will help you have more of a polished feel to your beard Alright, so I'm just going to use circular motions to help reach your skin underneath your beard. Okay, so I'm now just going to be washing my hands as I let that exfoliant sit on your skin for just a moment. Okay, so now I'm going to be washing off that exfoliant and then we shall proceed to your shave. going to grab a little bit more water okay. How are you feeling? Relaxed? Very good
So, what kind of shave would you like today? Would you like a trim? Would you like certain parts shaved? Or would you like all of your beard off? All of it? Okay. Okay. So, before we begin then with your shave, as your beard hair is a little long, I'm just going to give you a quick trim before we begin with the shave. Okay? Okay, so now that your beard is trimmed down, it'll make it a lot easier to work with and allow for a closer and smoother shave. Okay, so I have prepared for you some shaving cream and I'm now going to be applying that to the shaving brush and we're going to put this all over your beard region Thank you. 
So that is your shaving foam applied and now I'm going to be moving on to your shave. For your shave today, I will be using a barber's blade for a smoother and closer shave. Okay. So I'm just going to bring my towel with me so that I can collect the hair and shaving foam. Have you ever had a barber shave? No? So I'm just going to start on this side the middle So we are almost done with your shave and I will just 
wash off the excess shaving foam after we're done. Okay, so that is your shave complete. And now I'm just going to just remove the excess shaving foam on your skin. Okay, so your skin is feeling and looking very smooth. And that's without the additional moisturizers that I will be putting on your skin in a little bit. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So that is the shaving part of your treatment complete. Would you like to just have a look in the mirror? You like the look? Excellent. So now I'm going to be moving on to your facial. So I noticed that your skin type is mostly normal with some dry patches. So I will use skincare products for your particular skin type. Okay, so to begin your facial today, I will be using this particular cleanser. A cleanser is very good at helping to remove makeup and it is also very beneficial in helping to remove dirt or sweat that has accumulated on your skin throughout the day. Okay, so I'm firstly going to begin by wetting your skin overall from your forehead to your chin. Okay, So this will help to apply the cleanser a little easier and it will help to massage the product into your skin. So men's facials are, while similar to women's facials, a little bit different in the way that the skincare treatments are provided and that is because typically men's skin is a bit different to women's. Men's skin for example is on average 25% thicker than women's. Men's skin also has more collagen density and men tend to produce more sebum oil from their skin, which is why men have a tendency to break out 
in their skin a little bit more commonly than women. So, the skincare treatments that we provide are tailored a little bit differently for men. Mm -hmm. Okay, so your skin is nice and damp, which means that I can now apply the cleanser to your skin. Okay. So, this cleanser has a light fragrance to it, slightly musky and floral. I'm just going to buff this into your skin. Down your nose. And on your chin and jaw. Just a little bit more on your forehead. Okay, so that is your cleanser applied. Now I'm going to remove it from your skin. Okay, so that is your cleanser removed. And now to buff away the dead skin cells on your forehead, cheeks and nose, I'm going to be going back now to the exfoliant that we used at the beginning of your shaving treatment, okay? So as your skin is already wet, I can apply the exfoliant immediately to your skin. So, as I have already exfoliated your chin and jaw area, I'm mostly going to focus the exfoliant on your forehead and nose. And I'm using circular motions with my fingers to help buff away the dead skin cells on your forehead and nose. So, interestingly, every time you do shave, you are technically exfoliating your skin. However, using an exfoliant before you shave helps to create a smoother surface before your shave and ultimately makes the shaving process a little bit easier. Okay, so that is your exfoliant applied, and now I'm just going to remove that. Okay. Just want to remove all of the product.
okay? So I have removed your exfoliant and now we're going to be moving on to the final step of your skincare treatment today. So lastly today, I will be applying this moisturizer to your skin. This is a lovely product from Neutrogena. This is their Hydra Boost Gel Cream for extra dry skin. This moisturizer has a lovely consistency to it. And so I'm just going to be applying this to your skin. Okay, so that is your shave and skin treatment complete. You like it? That's great. Well, thank you so much for visiting us today at the spa. Take care. Goodbye.